tip, I want to talk to you about when you're erasing at the table when you're drawing as an artist. So most people when they're using an eraser, so I'm talking about like the white plastic eraser, that's a traditional eraser that most people learn to use when you're in school, uh, as against the artist's kneadable eraser, which I won't talk about. But if you're using one of the little white erasers that you know when you rub the pencil off on the paper, a whole pile of little bits of this rubber stuff um, go on the paper. And your instinct is probably what you've been doing for your whole life when you have that all that rubbishy stuff sit on the paper, is to just give a swipe and flick it away from you. So what I teach in the uh, watercolour beginners course is that we have to start learning a totally opposite direction, which is kind of strange. But when you're drawing up your watercolour, often you've got a whole pile of uh, palettes and dishes and lovely wet paint all around your workstation and if you were to just flick that eraser forward it's going to just fall all into those dishes of paint or into your brushes and when you're painting you'll have all of these little bits showing in your painting and it actually pulls the pigment towards them and you'll get great big dark marks with the paint wherever those little spots of things are inside the paint or in the brush that have landed on the paper. So what you need to do is instead of erasing uh, and brushing the pieces of the eraser away from you, is you have to start learning to drag them towards you off the paper so that they land in your lap. So as artists, we have to kind of unlearn a few things. In the Learn to Draw class, we unlearn how to use the pencil the way we were taught when we were little. And as watercolourists in the beginner's watercolour course, we've got to unlearn how to brush the eraser mess off the paper. We have to pull the eraser bits towards us and into our lap so that it doesn't go and end up in all of the dishes of paint. It's sort of a bit of a strange one, but it's so crucial. If you don't get this right, you'll have some really horrible things happening on your watercolour painting. So always get into the habit of brushing your eraser bits towards you and off the table edge that way. Thanks for watching.